Mine always no, good today. Um, a little bit. You know, I, it's really great when they're in the races. The star um, here. Maddie yeah, Perez, Glenn oh, Bard West, me, which, um, I, you know, I love won the 1600 um, in record it time. It makes it more fun when you're she going ran, into the race and you know that you've got the best of the best record, up there against you and they're going to give it their all and you're going to give it your all. And, yeah, I love the love that they were in there. Um, how was the wind just picking up now? Is it, was it very bad during the race? Uh, it no, it wasn't too bad actually. Uh, Compared to the past two weeks, it was <laughs> virtually windless. Um, yeah. Just like there is a little bit, but um, if anything, there was a little bit coming into the home stretch. That was about it, and uh, didn't really take too much notice to it. So it was actually pretty nice. Well, how important is it? You know, obviously you've had a lot of success. I mean, you know, getting the meet record here at this meet, it's, it's kind of a big deal just because you know. Yeah, absolutely. Um, it's an honor, you know, the CP meet, it's our home meet, and I really wanted to represent my school and my coaches and family, friends, Miss P herself, you know. Yeah. Uh, I wanted to do my best for all of them, and uh, it's an honor to have the record at this meet. Uh, I'm just happy that we were able to have it. <laughs> a little, I was a little bit worried on uh, Thursday when I went down to our track and uh, couldn't find it, but, <laughs> but uh, other than that... It's a, it was a great meet. So what was your practice regimen on Thursday and Friday? Did you uh, run somewhere else then? Or, uh, no, we just kind of were trapped uh, <laughs> inside. Okay. Um, we actually didn't have school on Thursday. They just canceled it completely. Right. Yeah. But um, yeah, it was kind of weird having the rain Wednesday, Thursday, and then a little bit of like snow yesterday, just in the funkiest weather. But uh, we've been able to deal with it and get through it, so yeah, it was all right. Were you in your neighborhood? Did you have any flooding? Were you um, in yeah, we actually got... About six inches in our basement alone. Oh, really? But, wow. um, okay. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> and our entire area, just, you know, there's areas that do get floods and right. others that are up a little bit higher and are fortunate. But, um, I mean, what, you, can, you can only do what you can do. I mean, you can't really stop Mother Nature, but that's <laughs> yeah. all right. Um, you know, where do you feel like you're at right now? I mean, obviously, um, you know, it's a great race that we all saw last week and everything. And, I mean, you're pretty happy with you know, where it just seems like it's been so disruptive. I mean, you know, sure. that the weather has just not been cooperative. Yeah, I mean, absolutely. It hasn't been the greatest yeah. um, weather-wise this outdoor season, but you kind of just have to take what you get, and you can't really think about it because, you know, everyone else is running in the same conditions that you are. But um, yeah. for the most part, I was happy with today, uh, happy with my 4 bait, and then happy with my 1600 that I just ran to. So, um at a good start. We're about midway through outdoor. I can't believe it already. But uh, <laughs> Number one in the state. Thank you so much. Yeah, it's pretty exciting right now. We're getting closer every single week to state, and um, we'll just see how it goes. I'm getting excited. You, you and the coach are still kind of talking about where you're going to be at state. I mean, that, that's the big question, yeah, obviously. I know. Um, as of right now, I'm still undecided, and, uh, you know, just as we get closer to conference and and obviously I'll have to decide right. by sectionals uh, yeah. we'll make the decision but I just kind of got to see you know what I need to do for my team right now and and then and we'll make the decision yeah. in a few weeks what would you prefer oh, oh geez I don't know I, stop I, being modest I, I have to I mean I just every single event from the 4 way to the 16 to the 32 you know doubling one way or the other whether it's the 4 way 16 or the 32 16 I'll be happy because uh, I just love everything so um, either way, I'll be extremely happy. So. Yeah, I mean, when you see what Emma's capable of doing in the open eight and the four by eight, I mean, that's yeah. got to make you guys kind of excited. Obviously. Oh, extremely so. excited! Emma's just having the season of her life. I'm so proud of her, and uh, it's just so fun having someone like that on my team to uh, look up to. And I'm gonna miss her so much next year, but uh, couldn't be happier for her. And and it's really exciting. Looking forward to state now. You know. Yeah. What Glenbird West can bring and do. Yeah, uh, what about too? I mean, obviously coming off the cross country. I mean, yeah. you know, how did how long did you celebrate that, and how long did? You um, come on, guys. Couldn't celebrate too long right <laughs> after the fact because uh, I was training for Nike Cross Nationals, right. which right. Um, yeah. was a blast. Tony here was. I was our manager. The best okay. manager that there was, but um. <laughs> Thank you. Anyway, uh, yeah, it was it was really nice. Um, you know, it definitely helped me make it through that cross country season, and I still think about it today when I need to pick me up and uh, get the same excited feeling every time I think about it. But um, try not to dwell too much in the past because uh, there's a lot of exciting things that uh, opportunities to come still, and um, that's kind of what my focus has been. Yeah, where do you feel like track last year to this year you are? I mean, you know, do you feel like you're more comfortable out there? I mean, you, uh, yeah, you, look, you look really comfortable. Thank you. Um, 
Yes, this season has been super fun, super relaxing. Um, I go out in every race just kind of thinking, you know, what do you have to do to be your best today? I try not to think about the weather or the competition or the length of the race. It's just more kind of racing myself, and uh, it's just been such a blast. Are you starting to think about recruiting a little bit more, too? Um, yes, I have been. Uh, uh, with the NCAA rules, it's kind of uh, pretty strict on what you can and cannot talk to coaches and when and where and how. So, um... As of right now, I'm just focusing on my track season, and uh, after we get through that this summer, um, is when I think I'll start taking some more visits and looks around okay. to kind of see. But as of right now, I'm completely undecided, and yeah. Are you, it should be fun. Do you, do you have a timetable for that? Would you like to decide before next um, cross season, or is it is it that, is that, that important? Or not? You know, I'm not completely sure. Uh, okay. It just kind of all depends with how everything goes. Um, okay. When it comes, I can't wait. I keep, I kept, I, on the signing day this year, I was like, oh, I can't wait for that day. But um, right. it should be pretty exciting. I'm excited to uh, go through the recruiting process and, and everything. Yes, thanks, man. Thank All right, thanks. So thanks, Kay.